Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Marshal Technology back again with another video. And today, in this video, I will be reviewing the U4 Air OS for the Google Nexus 5. So, as you can see, the time it's 2:49 at night, and I'm shooting this video at night because it's silence. In the morning, you get you can hear the horns of cars and all that stuff. But as you can see, let's concentrate on the ROM. And the ROM version is 1.1, and it's running on Android. 5.1 which is the latest version of android and that's pretty much smooth and the best feature of this rom is it features theme engine which is really nice and that was really quick he this was the first rom to get, provide theme engine on android 5.1 as you can see i have a bunch of themes installed which it was pretty nice and uh, think with the features you get you get a great excellent battery life by the way and talk about the display you get some of the features you can live display feature and let me go ahead and zoom a bit you get live display feature you get ambient display feature double tap to sleep wake up on charge then you get touch control from which you can apply double tap to wake or sweep to wake many features you can just go ahead and check it out you get LCD density from which you can change the density I have changed that to 456 you get battery life notification light and these are all the other things you can go to bar buttons enable or disable, disable that then you can just change these you can uh, navigation ring or you can disable that and you get a lot of features then talking about the status bar you can just go ahead and change that from middle to center right and and more of the things you can add weather there as i added there then you can add some of the notification counts, appears indicator, brightness control, and many other things. Uh, take away the notification drawer, you get a lot of features. You get smart pull down, you get quick pull down from which you can get a uh, full thing from all just a one pull down. As you can see on the left side, you need to do twice. You get auto close panel, you get force expandable notification, you get these styles how do you set that and you can just set four here one row but i like this talk way i like to keep things stock and here are the features and you can look at other features you get privacy from which you can blacklist blacklist the people any guy or privacy guard you can enable privacy guard then here is a built in super suit built in root access which is really nice you get performance we can change your schedule or IO. I don't know anything about that. That's why I'm not gonna show you anything about that. And here are all the features of this ROM by the way. So now you get notification manager from which you can head up notification, notification access, interruptions, app notification. So here are all the information of the ROM and let me go ahead and show you some of the battery life things. It's screen on time was just four hours but still as I experienced that that was really nice and as you can see I use Snapchat a lot my name on Snapchat is at the Shubham Moria and you can just uh, link to that in the description to show you that uh, username would be there I don't know the exact username by the way I am pretty much active on Google Plus and this is the new game I just downloaded and uninstalled I just used that for 15 minutes and it used a bunch of battery life and here is our system UI so this is it guys if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and I use this ROM as my daily driver because this is a very nice ROM by the way this is it guys thanks for watching if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up if you want more videos like this don't forget to subscribe to my channel thanks for watching and I'll catch you in my next video